I'm Dr. Hamsa Subramanian. I'm a board certified allergist. And today we are going to talk about dust mite allergies. Now dust is universal. All of us are exposed to dust. And many of us will sneeze, will cough, probably have a little itchy eyes, but that's it. But there are a lot of patients who are affected by dust in a very severe way. Their allergies can act up, they can cough, their asthma can act up. They can have conjunctivitis, which is eye allergies. And in some patients with dust exposure, their eczema flares up also. So in the select few, we like to skin test them and diagnose them with dust mite allergy and offer treatments. Now all these patients have to make some changes in their environment, that definitely helps. But going beyond that, there are safe medications. There is the conventional allergy injections that is available, but the FDA has approved a sublingual immunotherapy pill. The dust mite pill is taken sublingually, which means under your tongue. It's approved for patients 18 and above. You take it at the convenience of your home. It does have some side effects, but generally it is very safe. Talk to your allergist about it or come talk to me. I'll be happy to talk to you because many of us who are allergic to dust really cannot avoid dust. It's everywhere. It's perennial. It's all year round. The more time you spend indoors, the more you're going to be exposed to dust. The more the humidity is very high inside, the more you're going to be exposed to dust. And most of us know we have enough dust collectors in our homes. We have pictures, we have blinds, we have a lot of dust mite um, products like carpets, pillows, mattresses. So there's a lot of things that does collect dust and bothers us and affects us in a very significant way.